It's a staple of the science fiction world, telepathy. Movies like X-Men explore the mind-bending possibility of communicating instantaneously without uttering a single word, simply by thinking it. Well, an international group of scientists say they've done just that. They've managed to use internet technology to send a telepathic message direct from one brain to another 5,000 miles away. The experiment involved two people, one in India, the other in France. The person sending the message wears a special cap connected to an EEG machine which captures the electrical signals their brain gives, in this case, thoughts of a moving arm. The signal is then translated into a code and sent via the internet to the cap of the receiver, whose brain experiences the message as a light in their peripheral vision. The co-author of the research says this is just the beginning. I think that if we are successful uh, with this technological development and we continue, we will eventually be able to uh, unite telepathically people across the globe um, and enrich deeply the, the, the information exchange between human beings and human beings and machines. And if I had to say a time scale, I would give it a 50-year time scale to see something uh, practical. Progress in this branch of neuroscience is inching ever forward. Last year, scientists say they managed to get two rats to communicate the location of treats hidden behind trap doors whilst in isolated boxes, all telepathically. At Harvard University, scientists were able to get someone to move a rat's tail just by thinking it. This research does pose some profound questions. Should the technology become widely available, it can change how we interact with each other. We still need the traditional ways of communicating if we're going to adopt new ways of communicating, but that doesn't mean to say that um, telepathy is going to necessarily be one of them, because I do think we've still got quite a lot to learn. But the potential is there to drastically improve what we're able to do. One day, if the technology does come where we could apply it, you could put it to good uses. You know, sometimes you're learning a tennis stroke and you're just not getting it right and your coach is staring his hair out. Maybe one day they could just communicate with your brain and tell you what to do. If we got there, we would have to develop a legal and ethical framework for the application of these technologies in science. We're not talking about Charles Xavier-style mental mastery just yet, but the world of neuroscience is opening the doors to telepathic communication.